Wanted to shoot a brief video. I've been involved with the world of custom knives for 30, 35 years basically. Um, besides the fantastic knives, the greatest part of this journey is the people that I've met, the makers, the collectors, the users, the martial artists, the, the gambit of everybody that's attracted to high performance cutlery, and the world of custom knives and cutlery in general. I've had the privilege of having some of the best makers in the world as good close friends. Um, recently I've gotten very acquainted with TK Steingast. I did a couple New York specials with him, actually three of them. For a Loveless rendition, um, TK is giving so much for the money. His New York specials, and I'll, I'll post a picture of them real quick. Are fantastic. These knives are really well done. Recently TK sent me a fighter to take a look at and um, it's a beautiful knife. I don't know if you can get the angles on it. Black my car to handle. I'm assuming stainless steel is the guard. I'll put the blade steel up. He didn't tell me what it is. I guess he's trying to let me use it a little bit and then try to guess maybe. Um, I can definitely see the inspiration TK got in, you know, where he got the inspiration for this knife. I see a lot of Sam Lurkin. I see a little bit of Jason Knight. What maker doesn't have inspiration from two of those guys? Um, this is a, a very Hurok, as in Sam Lurkin, type knife. And um, it feels that way. And just like the Hurok, it's an awful big little knife. And what I mean by that is it's got a big full size handle with a big flare at the end. It captures in the hand extremely well. You can see it transitions quickly. Again, just a really neat, medium sized, I call it a, a fighter, a hardcore hunter. TK's grinds are exceptional. His tip is fantastic. It's razor sharp. You can see he's extended the clip down to about here. Very knightish in his clip. All in all, it's just a fantastic, fantastic knife. TK is a gem of a maker, it really is. I think um, those of you who have seen TK's work have been very impressed. TK does a lot of Loveless designs, plus his own designs, takes inspiration from where he gets it, and is, the, is a phenomenal maker and a phenomenal gentleman, gentleman. And also him and I share a lot of love for the outdoors, hunting. I found out he's a, a single string, as in stick bow shooter also. So just, again, um, I've really enjoyed meeting TK, getting to know TK, and seeing his work. TK Sheese, I don't know if this, you can see this right here, okay? Um. TK does great leather work. So many makers, I'm gonna take off my belt and show you the sheath a little bit more detail. So many, um, so many, so many leather, or so many knife makers, make a nice knife, but they don't make a good sheath. They make bad sheaths. Most knife makers don't provide with a suitable sheath. TK really is killing it with leather. Now it's not your crazy fancy sheaths, even though I'm sure they're in his wheelhouse, but just really nice, heavy, utilitarian, great sheaths. This is in a cross stroll, the way I like to carry these style knives. As you can see, what TK's got down pat is retention. You feel that knife click in there? That's incredible. I mean, that's like it went into Kydex. He's obviously wet molding the mouse. It's got, you, you've got to basically grab it, either shuck it hard or put your thumb here, and the knife pops right out. But I mean, what a total package. And that's hard to get these days. So again, TK, wonderful, wonderful fighter slash hybrid hunter. Very much enjoy it. I'm going to Put it to some use and I'll get back to you on how it performs. Again, fantastic package. TK Steingast, I'll put up his website. Thank you. The video won't be complete without me bringing in the bull terriers. Here's Lady. She's 13 months old. She's 52 pounds of awesomeness terrier. She's wicked in the woods. She's a great hunter. She's gorgeous, great muscle. Let me find her brother. And here is Max the Terrible. Max is a bruiser. 
Max is about 60 pounds almost now. He is awesome. Look at him. He's a big meathead. But he's, they're both awesome in the woods and great dogs. 13 months old, Bull Terror.